you like but the, but I, I I like the Packers. It's a hunch and 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 I think. Oh, Col- I got the Packers. You got the Seahawks. I mean, I, I like. <laughs> Go again. Yeah, I got him. With that, <laughs> sports, that really throws them off. Let me tell you why I like the Packers, even though they're they're at a disadvantage at this yeah, point, it's... due to the fact that they don't have as much playoff experience as the Seahawks does. The Seahawks have been in the playoffs the last three years. Brett Favre is on a run. He's on a magical ride, and reports have it that Brett Favre will be returning for another year. Okay, I'm going to ask you a question before we go any further. Yes. Who do you pick as the dark horse team to, that can win it all? The Jaguars. The Jaguars. Why? Because they're hungry. Uh, they hit hard. <laughs> Go ahead. Um, and it's a cat. Wow. You know who I pick? Who? I pick the Jaguars for, for, for the national. For the AFC. But for the AFC, my, my, my wild card pick is uh, San Diego. San Diego? I, San Diego doesn't have enough. You're going to be missing damn well uh, 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 Antonio Gates. He's got a dislocated toe. Yeah. How are you going to push off with a dislocated toe? He Use the other foot. What is he, peg leg Bates? He's going to uh, push off. Again, yeah. He's going to push, push off. off. And after he pushes off, he, he's okay. Okay, now why do you feel that the, that the Chargers would be your dark horse? Okay, I got the Jaguars from the AFC. Now, no, from would, the NFC. No, Jaguars AFC. Are they AFC? Yeah, they AFC. Oh, so they can't. They, they, They're taking uh, on the Patriots, and I got the Jaguars versus the Patriots. Wow. Yeah. You got guts. Yes. Tres huevos. Can uh, I say that? No, you can't say it. <laughs> Thank God they don't know what you're saying. <laughs> listen, I said you got guts. I didn't say you had tres huevos. But uh, listen to me. <laughs> listen to me. This is a whole nother show, baby. Oh, this uh, is. This is more like this is more like cheap cheap sports. Okay, please, I apologize for anybody that was offended by that. And if you weren't offended, call Robert Cumberbatch at 582-655-1314. And if you get anybody at uh, Bronx now to pick up the phone, <laughs> good luck. Just um, don't ask for engineering. Um. <laughs> Go ahead. Red is positive, black is negative. Okay, that's an, ele- <laughs> that's an, that's an electronics joke. Okay, um, that's who I that's who I see, and I, I uh, the Jaguars are going to do a number on the Patriots. They 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 play pretty hard. They San Diego good. plays who? San Diego. Uh, let me read the line. The San Diego uh, Chargers have the Colts. They'll be on the road, and the Colts are getting seven and a half. Okay, so uh, uh, okay, well, I, I, I'll go with your pick then. I'll go with the Jaguars for the dark horse in in the AFC. Okay. Now, as for the NFC, who do you pick as the dark horse? Uh, for the you NFC. had to look at the paper. Don't look yes, at the paper. I have to look at the paper. Go ahead. Who do you pick as the dark horse? Do, 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 do. Who do you pick as the dark horse? Who do I pick as the dark horse? The Giants. That's the dark horse. Yeah. The Giants are not supposed to stand a chance. They're blue. They're not dark. Yes, but it's dark enough because their colors are darker than the I other. pick Seattle. Seattle? Seattle? No, Seattle has already gone to the NFC Championship game within the last three years. That's right. That's my... That's, they went Why to the Super Bowl. They... they went to the Super Bowl. Oops. They went to the Super Bowl and they lost, and that's why I'm picking them. Because I think I think that, honestly, I think they can, they can win they it. They won't be able to do it because Sean Alexander is the former running back of what he used to be. No, 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 no. Right now, the, w- le- 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 start thinking really. Seriously, look, I said this on last week's show, and, and, and I don't know if people agree with me, I, but I, I will tell you, the year the running back is over. The year of the running back? The, the, well, what is it now? The wide out? It's, because of it's Randy all Morris, about, it's all about the receivers and how you got the guy that has the ball getting it to the wide receivers. That's what it's been. It's not a running back game anymore. I mean, you get running backs with 1,000 yards. If you get one with 1,200, 1,600, even 1,500, that's all well and fine. Those are average years. Those are average years because I remember back in the day, a running back getting 1,000 yards meant was something. A, was a really, meant really something. big deal. Meant right? something. And now, the, what, you got running backs averaging, what, 1,200 yards a year? There's a guy named Al Carlton who's got 1,000 some odd, and, and the guy is he a nothing. He retired. He's nothing. He retired. After nothing. That. That's right. Nothing. <laughs> so it's all about passing. It's all about passing. And, and let me tell you, Alexander, all he has to do is be an adequate running back. He doesn't have to dominate. He doesn't have to well, dominate. Wait a 
we all know in football 101, yeah. the run sets up the pass. Not if you play on New, not if you're, you're a New England Patriot. The pass has been setting up whatever they want to do, whether it's pass again or run, well, and it, and it's been set. It's well, been like that all season, and you know it. The, the Patriots have man, they've got an awesome. Uh, receiver calls and long to go with Tom Brady. What can but I, I look, I seen the Pittsburgh Steelers. I don't want to hear about how they're awesome. I seen the Steelers when they had Swan. Oh, when, when, Swan. when they had Storworth. Swan and Storworth. And, and, and the tight end. What was the, what was the tight end's name? Uh, I don't know. Al, what was the tight end's name? Oh, never mind. It was a tight end. But, but they, I mean, they had great tight ends. And I seen the Miami Dolphins, but you, you still had to have a running game. Now, the running game is not that important. As long as you, that running back can get you that first down when he has to or get a good five, six yard when you give him the ball, you know, or even if he gets three yards just to, just to, throw, just to throw him in there so that the offense could come up with another passing play because it's all passing. Yeah, it, it's, it's gone big time passing. I mean, that's what the NFL wanted. They wanted more touchdowns, and you're not going to get it with the running game. No, but the running game is part of football. I love it. It's it's part of the game. I grant you that. So, okay, but it's been domi- this year has been a pass dominated game. Okay, so so far we've gone through most of the games, right? Um, I'm taking the Packers over the Seahawks. I'm taking the Packers, and you're taking the Seahawks, right? Right. Uh, I'm taking the Jaguars, and you're taking the Patriots. No, I'm 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 gonna, you joining the Jaguars. I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the Jaguars because we picked them as our underdog team, but but. Realistically, you know, I, I think that the Patriots can go undefeated all year, but I, I'm picking the Jaguars. I'm looking for the Jaguars to, to be the team to knock the Patriots off. After that, I don't think the Colts both, will have a chance. Both of those are uh, both of the, the Jaguar game and the Packer game are Saturday's games. <laughs> mm-hmm. And then the Sunday games are the Giant Cowboys. Giants. Which is you which you pick the Giants mm-hmm. and I pick the Cowboys. Mm-hmm. And you pick the Chargers and I'm picking the Colts. Yes. No. You pick the Colts, and I'm picking the Chargers. Okay. I got the Colts. He's got the Chargers. I've got Manning throwing to Harrison, Reggie, Wayne, Gonzalez. That rookie, he's 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 hot, man. I played with them in Madden. Yo, you put them in the slot, and you run either an in route. What you do is you, you'll have them run out and send a wide receiver deep. And in that way, you can definitely get your yardage and then keep working on something else. You're disgusting. I love Madden, man. You're, you're, you're advertising for... for no, mind. I'm not advertising. I'm talking about a game that I play in my leisurely time, in my off time. And it's a sport you, I like Did you play. buy it? Hmm? Did you buy it? Buy every year. Oh, all yeah. the installments. Every time Madden comes out, we So you it. have last year's? Yes, we do. And the year before? So. Yes, we do. And the year before that? We got all the way back to 04 when they started putting it out for the, for the two. You're, for not, the two. you're not, you're not going to get the, the, the next year's, though. Can't until it comes out. When it comes out, then I'll get it. You can't get it. Why? Because it's not going to be for two. No, that's right. No, no, no. You're going to no, have to get no, three. No, nah, yeah. man. no, 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 no. You're gonna have no, to get three. No, they can't. They can't. Nah, nah, no, I, he's upset. Yo, wait a minute, <laughs> man. Said, nah, nah, come shut on, up. Son. Shut up. Oh. Jesus, this is not a show about video games. Anyway, but for oh, all you that don't know that Madden, Madden uh, for next year, it's not gonna be for PS2. It's only gonna be for PS3. So, oh, if you wanna play yeah. a nice piece of change, I won't mention how much money it is. But it, you know it's a nice piece of change to that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a second story job. I mean, um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna have to do that second job. <laughs> but anyway, uh, anyway, so so I mean, that's about it that's for about football. It. That's about it. But for football. you 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 think you think the Colts, right? Uh, I think the Colts will be. See, the Jaguars got to knock off the Patriots. In order that's going to be tough, you that's know. That's going to be tough, but I don't care. I'm going to be looking for a game because you know why? They don't care. They have nothing to lose because when they get up every day before they got to this game, it's like the Patriots, the Patriots. Oh, you're 11 and a half. You're supposed to lose. The key to that Jaguar game, though, you know what the key is? Gerard? The, Gerard? The, no, the key to the Jaguar game, and now this is when, this is when it, it's going to come in handy. What I talked about just a minute ago, is they're going to have to run to keep Brady off the field. Ah, see, that's where the running game comes in. That's where the running game comes in. That's when you have to eat the clock. Because if you go in the air, you ain't going to eat the clock. And if you can't eat the clock up against them and and let Brady come on that field and keep him him off the field, Mm -hmm. if you can't do that, you know that the Patriots won the game. Unfortunately. So there you go. Okay, what else we got on the – Well, we're going to talk about – Somebody who was on 60 Minutes, I don't know, some guy who used oh, to throw a fastball. Man. And now he, 
He's throwing a forked tongue. Anyway, we'll be back with more cheap seats, so don't go away.